when listing content in Drupal on the admin slash content page, it shows us the author of a piece of content, but doesn't show us the name of the last person who edited the content. And often, maybe when you migrate content, it could all be migrated in as coming from admin or coming from uh, anonymous or whoever, but you want to see, you know, as the content gets edited, who made the last change. Uh, it took a bit of Googling around to figure out this because all of the blog posts I found and Reddit um, items and things all link to posts that are kind of workarounds before there was actually a solution in Drupal Core, which actually came in a number of years back in Drupal 8, but I, I, I hadn't seen it before and I'm not aware of it. I'm guessing lots of others may not be aware of it either. So we've got our general content listing page here and it shows the content author. Now, this is a content listing page rather than a content, um, say, the node revisions listing page. And that's why we don't get the, 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 the name of the person who last updated content because that's part of a revision as opposed to the node itself. But to, uh, to get that now, uh, we can so come to views and our content view. And over here on the relationships, we had a new relationship for a user, I think it is. And the user content revision. So this is the username of the content, sorry, this one here, the user ID of the author of the current revision. So we'll add this relationship here. Um, let's say we require it. And then over here on the fields we want to show, we can have a look for the user. I mean, now we get this revision user here. So the user ID of the quarter author of the current revision. So we'll apply this. I will say last edited by, and we'll just rearrange these that are in a slightly different order. Uh, so we've got the username here. This is the person who created the um, node and decide that we put the last edited by. Save the page. And when we come back here and refresh. So we can see now that, for example, here, Mike King wrote this blog post here, how to avoid email delivery problems with Gmail and Yahoo. But Alison Visser was the last person to update it. Um, that's it. It's pretty simple. Alison created this and the admin has updated it. Very simple, but very handy, especially on kind of websites for larger organizations where there could be a lot of editors and, and, and you want to have a kind of a quick look here at who, who was the last person to change it.